Are you ready for this, everybody out there? I'm, I'm She's ready. <laughs> it's National Clam Chowder Day. That is right. And our girl in the bay is at the home of the bread bowl. One of my favorite ways to enjoy a bowl of chowder. Mm. <laughs> Malou. Hey, Malou. Hi. Happy National Clam Chowder Day. Oh, yeah. This is, uh, well, one of the key ingredients is definitely this bread bowl, which is why we are at Boudin's in San Francisco. Misael. So one of the key ingredients for the clam chowder is definitely the sourdough. Sourdough. Yeah, yeah. right? We've been uh, <clears throat> making bread. Uh, since 1849, so we're lucky to be in San Francisco and have a nice sour day. Yeah, because since 1849, well, that's the mother dough came from here, right? And yes. it's all about the climate and the fog. Yes. You know, the weather in San Francisco kind of helps the moist on the, on the, on the flower. It kind of helps the, the bacteria and the mother dough to kind of grow faster and kind of like better. Yeah, and they make like, what, 20,000 pounds of bread out of here? A bread, yeah. Okay. It's a lot of loaf of bread. All right, well, let's head out here because right now we want to fill this bowl with some clam, clam chowder. Clam chowder. We're going right. to know how to make clam chowder today. Okay, what are a couple of tips on the clam chowder? Well, first it was, for me, is uh, not burn the, the butter. Don't burn the butter. <laughs> Don't burn like the butter. It. Don't burn the butter. You shouldn't burn anything. Style. No. Okay. So what's the first so, thing we're going to do here? Okay. First of all, uh, just add all those liquids there. Okay. That's the clam juice. All right. I'm going to start doing my part. I'm going to add um, uh, extra virgin olive oil here. Okay. And then I'm going to add the butter because we don't want the butter to get burned so the uh, extra virgin olive oil will support the, the, the butter. Okay. So you're doing that. What I did here is I put some clam juice in here. Yes. I did some half and half. Yeah, now we're gonna put a little milk. bit of fire in it. Okay, yeah. what do you got going there? So I have some extra virgin olive with the butter. All I'm right. gonna get the butter get melt nice and hot, and then I'm gonna start adding my green. No, oh, no, no. Yep. The bacon it, makes everything better. Yeah, so it tastes this, better, yeah. Now, normally this takes about 15 minutes to cook, but we don't have 15 minutes, so we're gonna have to just keep throwing everything in here. Yeah, <laughs> so we're gonna start adding this right now. Okay. That's the bacon. That's the bacon. You hear the. So we're gonna keep cooking, stirring this. What else is gonna go in there? Besides? That's gonna be our celery. All right, celery. And then we're gonna add the uh, onions. Onion? Yes. Okay. So potato, we're gonna last our last minutes, okay? All right, so eventually what we're gonna do here is we're gonna put that in here, right? No, this one's gonna go here. This is gonna go in there? Yes, because okay. this one's gonna have flour, so that the, one of the key for me to make clam chowder is make sure your liquid they're gonna be hot all the time because you don't want to start the clam chowder over and over and cold from hot from cold and then adding cold stuff there. Okay. It's gonna take a long time to kind of make right. that clam chowder. Can we just for television sake, can we go ahead and pour this in there now? Yeah, I'm gonna add my flour in it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so. All right. So I'm now you, you can. I'm gonna let you keep stirring. Okay. Because if you're lucky, okay, what the clam chowder should look like is something a little bit like. Like this. this. So go ahead and you pour this little bowl right yeah. here. Go ahead and pour the bowl. A bowl. You need a bread bowl over here? Yes. Okay, Miss Isle. Thank you very much. Go ahead and pour that. Okay. Danny and Jess, you know, this normally would take a long time here, but for right now, we're going to pour it in there, and hopefully you two got your clam chowder, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we, we did. did. <laughs> I've been you eyeing did. it this whole time. We did. Well, happy Thank National you. Clam Chowder Day. Thank you, Misai. Thank you for being here. I gotta have some of this. It's been cold here, so this is gonna be nice and warm and ready you to You need enjoy. to hurry up and eat it so we can dig into ours. <laughs> <laughs> oh, delicious. Thank you. Happy National Clam Chowder Day. Happy to you. All right, enjoy. All right. Same oh, to you. Good. All right, well, I think we should just go ahead and try this because she's making it look really good. I know. Let's handle a little business first. For more mm -hmm. about clam chowder mm -hmm. secrets mm -hmm. on all of our stories, go to our website, NBC. CALive.com. <laughs> you got it. I got it. <laughs> Have a great rest of your Monday, everyone. And I'm going to just go ahead and pick this up and then try some. Yeah. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay, mm. here we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, you got the nice little sourdough bread from Boudin. Mm. Oh, this is great. Mm -hmm.